In Terminator 2K23, there's a lot of really awesome versions of John Cena that you can play as. One of my favorites is the invisible John Cena that you get only by unlocking him in Showcase. Did you know that you could actually play as action figure John Cena if you go to Walmart and get a participating action figure? Now, there's a full list on all the action figures that you can get. But I'll go ahead and give you the tips, the top secret stuff. If you go to Walmart.com and you look up this specific Reckoning action figure, it is only $10 because that action figure is actually going to be discontinued because Reckoning is no longer around. So go on there, get that figure, have it shipped to your house. You'll save some money. So without further ado, let's get into it and show off action figure John Cena. So once you redeem your code on the Ruthless Redemption website, you can get this John Cena along with a couple other cool things here. There's that 83 Ruby John Cena action figure style along with all of the awards, quick feet, logo, nameplate, and wallpaper. So without further ado, let's get into the match. Let's get John Cena in action. Well, maybe. If it ever wants to find an opponent. Okay. Come in. Come in. Is it ever going to go? Okay, finally, after a hundred hours, we got into a match here. There it is, John Cena versus Matt Riddle here. We are playing online with the very first time at this John Cena action figure. And look at this guy. This is such a... It, man, it feels like Robot Chicken Adult Swim style stuff here watching this action figure play. This is actually really cool. You know what? I actually think this style, okay, he's, he's taking it to me. I actually think this style might be a really cool concept for a video game. He's going for the pin already? There's no way. Uh, yeah, oh, reversal. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that, what I was saying was this is actually really cool style of figure. I think it's really sweet. I think if they made a whole game out of it or, or release some more action figures, I think that would be, oh, be really cool. Now, I know a lot of people are complaining that you can't use this action figure outside of my faction, and that really does bum me out as well. But, you know, they want you to play my faction. I understand from, like, a marketing aspect why they lock it behind there, but I feel like once you unlock it, you should be able to use it for single player. Maybe if that was the case, you could actually have more people playing my faction so they can use it in regular modes. I know you should be able to keep them on, you know, offline but i do think my faction being able to use them there oh sidestep let's go uh being able to use them in my faction and then using them offline would be a, a cool little thing there because i definitely would go on and play a fun fact here i will let you know before we get into this i know the editing of the video was a little bit faster pace but it took me about 20 minutes to get a match online i had to restart the console multiple times i Tried to get on the game. It just wasn't working. I closed the app. I came back. I, I rebooted it. And finally, it let me online, and I got a stable connection. Uh, this is in the afternoon, so I didn't think the servers would be that too loaded, but they just weren't working for me. But here we go. We're finally doing it. Again, it's crazy how they made this look and how realistic it is. There it goes. Code Red by John Cena. One of the awesome moves that he has in the action figure Cena. Again, this guy is just the coolest looking thing ever. It's such a, a drastic change from what's going on, but it looks very realistic, and I kind of like it. It brings it back to, oh, you can't see me. Here we go. Five knuckle shuffle. We're going to hit it. We're going to hit that five knuckle shuffle and busted him open. Okay, let's go for the pin here, maybe. Nah, just kidding. We're going to hit that finish. The attitude adjustment from John Cena. Trying to time it right because we're playing online, of course. Oh, he blocked it. He reversed it. No. Okay. We got we to gotta bide our time here. Just kind of stay away. Get that timing down. It's very difficult for me to get used to this online timing for the reversals, but I think I'm finally getting it after playing for a little bit here. There it is. Another reversal. Oh, another code red. That's just a really sweet move. Go for the pin. Let's see if we can get it. That might be it. Ooh. I thought that was it, but it was not. Uh, but back to what I was saying, yes, this action figure version is very sweet. I think that if they included more of them in the game, I definitely want to play as more of them. Um, again, you have to spend about $10 if you go for the Reckoning figure. Some of the figures are upwards of $20. I mean, you can get a figure that you like if you're a figure guy. Uh, just get the figure that you like and then play as this John Cena. I think that's pretty cool. I'm also excited that it's not... Okay, what's he doing here? Oh, he's getting out of it. Oh, this is not looking good. This is not looking good. 
I'm uh, excited that it's not locked to just that John Cena figure, and there's a whole list of action figures that you can choose from, because if I had to get just that John Cena one, I don't know if I'd be able to find it. One other thing that I have noticed is that this is a U.S. thing only, that international people aren't able to get it, which is kind of a bummer. But maybe you could go to Walmart.com, get a friend's address, have it shipped to them in the U.S., and then you could just use that receipt and redeem it online. I mean, that's the only option that I see there. Here's reversal. There we go. Ooh, okay. He's pretty good. He's getting that reversal. Again, I don't have any side plates here. I'm just playing with this base John Cena Ruby because uh, I didn't feel like I needed to use any side plates on this match. I figured we'd do all right without it. We got the best card in the game, at least for my deck, is the best card in the game. I'm not actually sure if this is the best card that they have in the game, but I think it's really awesome. I think it's the best one that I have. Without spending any in-game money, I mean, I spent money on the action figure, but without spending in-game money, you got a pretty sweet action figure here. Okay, what is he doing here? Did he disconnect? Is that what's going on here? Is he not in here? Is he waiting for me? He's going to get counted out. What is he doing? Oh, there he goes. Ooh, we got it with the line. I wasn't sure I was going to hit that, but we did connect with that. Okay, we're almost there for the signature. Hit this again. This is a, you know, we never fail when you hit that one. Let's go ahead and hit that five-knuckle shuffle here. Is it going to pop up? Guess not. We'll pull him up, though. Here we go. Let's take him up. Electric chair drop. We tried this earlier. Can we do it now? Is he going to reverse it? Oh, and it looks like he did reverse it. He got out of it. Ooh. That's not a good look for me. There it is. Takedown. Uh-oh. Kick to the gut. Irish whip. Back. Oh, the knee. No, this is not good. I don't want to use that instant recovery because, well, I just burned it. I didn't mean to. I wasn't going to do that. I just did it. Oh, we go for the A, but it didn't pay off. We have another signature again. I wasn't going to burn that reversal, but I did. Now I'm just getting flustered here. I'm not sure what to do. Do we hit the signature? Do we hit the finisher? What do we do here? All right, let's wait for him to get up. Maybe we'll hold an AA. There we go, AA. We got it. Attitude adjustment. Let's go for that pin. Oh, he kicks out at one. Here's that two or something. Oh, five knuckle shuffle. Here we go. You can't see me. There it is. All the stars are here. All the moves. We hit them all. Let's go for that pin. That's going to be it. What? Not even a one count? Okay, is the online counter broken? I'm not sure. Attitude adjustment. No, we reversed it. We burned through everything. <laughs> no signature, no finisher. What are we going to do? Okay. When all this fails, go back for that code red and go for the pin there for the win. No. All right, there's got to be something going on here. I'm assuming he's using resins here. I haven't done enough damage or something. I'm not sure. Maybe he's got a side plate that helps him. Oh, reversal. We're almost there. We're almost there for that signature. We got the finisher. Let's go. Oh, he reversed it again. There is no way this guy is too good. He's getting that reversal timing down. I'm trying to, like, wait a little bit to hit the finisher. This seems to be working out. All right. Kick him while he's down. Yeah. Yeah. Oof. Dragon screw leg whip. Man, look at that blood on his head. Looks really good, actually. Uh oh. Power bomb by Riddle. No. Okay, he's going for that pin. All right, that was easy. That was easy. Can we reverse this? Man, I'm sweating here now. I was in control, but I feel like I'm losing it. Another power bomb. No. He's got a finisher as well. Go for the pin. Okay. They just want to get that win. Little do you know, my pin bar is incredible. It is huge. Oh, we got the reversal. We did it. We got the reversal. And we got a signature. Okay. All right. Code red again. Because <laughs> why not? Now let's hit that signature. Oh, STF. STF you. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Yes, we did it, STFU. Wow. Okay, John Cena is your winner. What a heck of a match that was. This is the coolest 
in-game model I think I've ever played in a video game. As far as the wrestling game goes, this might be the coolest character ever. 